will promise our people to harvest it, thus securing their safety. As Sentinel and Castellan, I must warn against this. You may do this for some gain now, but in the end, it will starve this house. If we don't, there may be no house forester at all. Yeah, right now we're not at the first fight, point. You're bound to lose when one breaks out. The fuck's Ethan wrong with you guys? Ethan has made his opinion known, and you will respect his decision. That's right, so everybody shut the fuck up. B Forgive us, my lord. We are, of course, here to serve you, as we served your father. Uh, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm about to show you my backhand if y'all don't shut the fuck up and get on your knees. For arrival. And kiss this motherfucking ring. We could offer him the iron wood in the courtyard. My lord, making this kind of offer outright may simply embolden Ramsay. There could be trouble, and all the house will be there to see it. Meet him in the hall. It will be more private, and he will not have an audience to play against you. Lord Ethan? No oh, shit. Uh... Uh, we'll, I will we'll bring him in the hall. In the great hall. A wise move, my lord. It's careless. Can't you see Tuttle is steering you wrong? That's enough, Royland. Lord Ethan has given his command. How many years have I served this house? I cannot listen to that bloody idiot anymore. Forgive me, my lord, but you are not ready to be lord of this house. You're likely to get us all killed. Not another word your father would not approve my lord okay now i remember who to fuck up at the end of this Royland's gonna be getting my Apologies, backhand my son i had expected better of him but now that it is settled we know what we must do now i know i'm glad i didn't pick him Ramsey snow in the great hall he probably would have pissed everybody off Ironwood, providing a safe future for this house and don't worry lord ethan I will stand beside you, where your sentinel belongs. Then perhaps we should adjourn. We have to prepare the house. Well, at least some people are respectful in this fucking job. There will always be those who question your leadership. Which is why you need allies you can rely on. Family. Mira has done everything she can in King's Landing, but there are others who can help us. What Such about as? your brother, Asher? I've heard the stories. Me. You want to bring him back? He's a skilled fighter. But what's more, he has the will to fight. A hunger for it. And that may prove to be useful. He always protected you and your sister. And we need all the help we can get. Yes, I hear what you're saying. Do you remember the Miller's boy? How he tormented you? I wanted to intervene, but your father said... Ethan must fight his own battles. But when Asher saw it, he didn't take a breath. He grabbed the Miller's boy by the neck. That was his first instinct. Asher knocked out half the poor boy's teeth. Huh. Poor kid. Of course, your father was furious. But you were in danger and there was nothing else Asher needed to know. Asher does not hesitate. He acts. And we need that. You have many fine mm. qualities. But you do not have that anger inside you. I'm not like that, but I don't need to be, do I? No, but you need someone who is standing beside you. So then, Malcolm, I have made my decision, and you shall retrieve my I'm brother. I'm trying to do what's best for this family, what this family needs. Ethan, let me send Malcolm to Essos. I mean, it would make sense because this fucking family's falling apart. Fine. Malcolm will go to Essos and bring Asher back. Thank you, Ethan. I'm glad you will let me do this. Know that you never stand alone. You are a forester. Mira stands with us, and she may be able to help us yet. I don't even know how I feel about all of this. I feel like something bad's gonna happen. I feel like everything's gonna backfire on me, and like, that's exactly how these fucking games turn out. You think you have the upper hand, and then it just all goes to hell. What's going on here? Oh, uh, pick it up. Oh, 
take seal? I'll take it, I guess. I, I mean, what's the difference? Pick up key. Take key. I don't know what the fuck. Am I doing bad things? Marjorie? Oh. Lady Marjorie is still with the king. I thought you might want to know. Thanks. Uh, what's your name again? I'm gonna Thank call you. you. You'll be Catherine. Catherine. I thought we were friends, Mira. When you dismissed me the other day, oh. I won't say it didn't hurt my feelings. <laughs> First, sorry about that. We've known each other for years. And yet to be treated like that. We are friends, Sarah. Truly. Friends trust one another. They don't hold secrets. Now Lady Marjorie thinks you don't trust me. And she values your opinion very much. Sarah, I... It had nothing to do with that. I, I think it was like a personal... Wait, what's going on? She walked My in lady, pretty upset. I'll leave you to talk. Is everything all right? Are you all right, my lady? Yeah, cause you look upset as hell. Oh, she just scowled at me. The Fuck king that. was not inclined to offer help for your family. Oh I'll shit! This mended. He, he ripped her dress. He said I was too easily swayed, and uh. he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. I allayed his fear, for now. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything again. Oh, Nothing shit. I said could cheer him. I'm so sorry, my lady. Yeah, I, I didn't mean... I never asked you for the king's help. Understand, it was my mother's plan, not mine. I just hope you can find some way to forgive me. Oh, no. I feel... <laughs> Like something bad's gonna happen. This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. Huh? I'm sorry. What do you mean? My lady. <sighs> Soon I will be queen. And maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now, we must both be cautious. Yeah, that was my bad. Raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse me, my lady. Damn, so everything's going to hell. Now the one person that can help me can't help me. Uh, I gotta go argue with this um, Chef Ramsay's guy. And then there's this pardon, guy. Man. It's I good to see you, man. You. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, my lady. Why did she back away from him? I was right before about Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. Walk with me. I just want you to know, I I can help you if you'd like. And your family, if you're willing to trust me. I hear all sorts of things. Things that could be useful for you. How can you help can me? Can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. You need allies. Explain Hopefully yourself. I've proven I could be useful to you. Hmm. I'm sorry. I, I really must go. Please don't despair. I know people who... What is it? People would be willing to help you. What is it? Shredder. I know where the turtles at. Better not be fucking with them turtles. I told you, Shredder. I'm always trying to fuck with them turtles, man. Can't leave them bitch asses alone. Hey, yo, where, where Raphael at? Where Raphael at? Right, right. Better walk away. Fucking looking for Raphael ass looking motherfucker. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Like I'm I'm tired, guys. I've been playing for a long time, so I'm fucking delusional. Mr. Royland. He should be here. I mean, not this game. I was playing another game not that long ago. More than honor. We'll do without him, and without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. You sure about Your that? Your men stand ready to act if needed. The gods, gods don't favor favored us, have they? My lord, remember our words. Iron from ice. From that which seems hopeless, comes strength. Actually, I, I like that quote. That's a pretty badass quote. 
Oh shit. Who's that? Hey, it's it's that motherfucker that was pile of timber. Not the place I'd want to be if there was a fire. Uh wood is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is it? May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton? Son of Roos Bolton. Although a bastard, Lord Ramsay has the full authority of Thank the you, Warden Lord. of the... That's enough. The name's Lud? More like Lard. Who Get is that bitch out of my face. Boy? Is he lost? May I offer you bread and salt, Lord Ramsay? I loathe bread and salt. Aren't you the little lord? Lord Whitehall told me you were young. <laughs> this. Look at you. I'm handsome too, huh? I, 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 you got a, a bit there. For the new warden of the north. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. Don't know what's so special about it. Your father will appreciate it, I hope. Our ironwood is highly sought after. My father is not so easily impressed. <laughs> well, how about not now? Bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Ah, I see. It seems the foresters have a talent for something after all. Lord Ramsay, we have another gift. We'd like to offer to your father. There are several ironwood groves along the borders of our land, all producing tall, strong trees. We'd like to give your father two of these groves in tribute. Give him? He is your warden. What's yours is already his. True, but I'm just trying to, like, Look Not that. get fucked up. Poor Forrester. Lord Ramsay. Come out where I can see you. We really must focus on the business at hand. Lord Ramsay, I understand you've come here for assurance of our fealty. Fuck fealty. We came here for justice. We'll get to your justice. First. Let's see you bend the knee to my father, Lord Bolton, Warden of the North. Words are wind. Anyone can say. Fuck it, I'll do it, because at this point, I don't think I have my any... Lord. Ha! Any that point of disapproving so of somebody. Now, was it? I don't want, I don't want him to do anything to my family, that's what I worry I about the most. about your loyalty. And I care even less about... A bunch of trees on some far-off hill. The Crown, however, wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields, chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. The fuck are the Starks? My father has promised as much to the King. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. We will double our efforts for your father, my lord. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It was a forester squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolton. Yet your man lived. He was within his right. They killed his family. Oh shit, I didn't mean that. Right. I meant like... He killed a loyal soldier in my father's army. Then you welcomed me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That oh, sort of shit. insolence from one of our loyal bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? The Ironwood? But that is our livelihood. Then you'd better well find another fucking job. You can't do that. Why oh, not? Oh shit. You know something the White Hills done? Uh we are talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. We have loyal craftsmen who make the finest weapons. 
The white tellers have no such craftsmen. Do you want ironwood for the next five years or the next fifty generations? The little lord does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your iron wood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. <laughs> to ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ah, oh, shit. They'll help maintain the king's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. This will cause more trouble, not less. <laughs> not for me. Son of a gun. This is not working in my favor. Everything seems to be backfiring at this point. You have a man you trust? My son. Griff. Who the Griff. fuck is Griff? We'll lead the garrison. You have no right. White Hills have no place here. Lads. Do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Duncan, don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, are you? Oh, great. This seems to be backfiring on me so much. Please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? She's a minor. Stay close, away from her. Oh, shit. Yeah, oh, definitely a minor. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. I never had a sister. Always wanted one. We have more to discuss, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. We'd get along well. You've gone too far, Lord Ramsay. I demand you let her go. I suppose you can stay. I agree. Aren't you the brave lord? I don't no. trust this. Oh, fuck. What have you done? No. But I don't want brave lord. Far too much trouble. Fuck. No, no, no. That's how it fucking ends. I think we've come to an understanding. I certainly feel better about all this. What have you done? However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. He fucking killed me. What the fuck? Take the boy as your ward. Kill him. They give you any trouble. What the fuck? I hope I get to kill this dickhead. Somebody help him. Fetch the mace quickly! That wasn't Chef Ramsay's at all. Shut the fuck up, fat lard. What the fuck happened? I died. What the fuck? Mm. Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you did it without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? What kind of bullshit is this? So, in all my efforts to please this jackass, 
I end up getting killed? This is fucking... This is stupid. Ugh. Disgusted right now. Skip the fucking credits. You don't deserve credits. Oh. Okay. Whatever. I, I, I'll, I'll get through this shit. Whatever. I'll figure this out in the next episode. Um. Damn. Okay. So. I guess we'll figure this out in the next episode. On episode two. So until next time, guys. Like and favorite. Subscribe if you want to see some more of me. And this is your boy, Origin Jados, signing out. Bye bye. Made a track when I step on the scene. I do or die all my life with or without a team. Fast or slow, bro. You can't catch me though. Too fast, too furious, too hungry for y'all to see. I mean what I say and say what I mean. I'm the goddamn reason hip hop's back on the street. Just to put work in the streets. Now I lay my work on beats and let them work for me. Yeah, so I close my eyes, work and stay on. It's a must. I go from dust till dawn. So I close my eyes, work and stay on. It's a must. I go from dust till dawn.